what do you think 2022 will be like? I don't even dare to hope that we'll be out of it at this point. I mean, day by day, <laughs> I just, I feel like the people who have wanted to get vaccinated are vaccinated. The people who don't, I don't think anything's going to change their minds, really. Are, but. so yeah, I kind of think 2022 is going to still have a lot of challenges. I don't think, you know, supplies are, it's going to take a while, I think, for the supply chain to yeah. fix back up. and. To be able to find juice boxes. Yay. <laughs> I was like, oh, it's the, last, the last one. I got the last one. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. Um, it's going to be a rough year, I think. What do you think 2022 is going to be like? Like, what's coming down the chute? Yeah. Um, I don't know. I think it'll be an interesting. I think the world is still in like a lot of flux. And I think like, I'm looking at it a lot from a working standpoint, being in an MBA, it's, you know, it's kind of all they talk about. Um, but it'll be interesting to see like where industries go with the fact that people don't want to work right now. And like, will they come back around to it and want to work? And then what happens? And like, where is the economy heading? Because that's an interesting one too. And when I graduate in May, am I going to want a job or not? Or is the world going to be so weird that I'm going to be like, no, nah, let's go travel for a little while <laughs> or something. Who knows? Who knows? My hope is that people who are willing to go back to the office, go to the office, that offices and businesses and um, restaurants and movie theaters and casinos and all that will be open and without wearing a mask, there won't be any restrictions. Twenty twenty two I think gonna be um I think it should be, I hope it be the year of um the year of uh, not protest but um activism. That's what I hope it be. Mm -hmm. That's what I hope it be a year of activism all over the place where people mm -hmm. are supporting each other. And, you know, because COVID do not discriminate. And this is something mm -hmm. we need to be strong with. And that means we need strong people in the leadership that can think. Um, a more, oh my gosh. Um, 2022, I'm hoping to be more relaxed, <laughs> mm -hmm. you know, um, and maybe replace it with, with good things, you know, like being more hopeful with like, and just be, try to be part of a change for the best, you mm -hmm. know, I guess, you know, mm -hmm. you know, uh, it, what the experience of this year brought us is a teaching, right? Teaching lesson for all. And then when that's the next, the following year comes up, it'll be a memory. Okay, mm -hmm. getting ready for new things. No, what yeah. else? What else do you think 22 will be like? Onward and upward. <laughs> I'm like afraid to like, even. I mean, I hope it's like, slowly getting better but like I definitely feel like I definitely feel like it I won't be surprised if it doesn't get back to like I feel like I'm hopeful I'm still hopeful that it will be back to how it was but like I kind of know that it won't be but like so so I won't be surprised if it's not but I'll be disappointed but I think slowly it will get better so I'm hopeful that 2022 will will be like the year where we actually get back on track, like for, for real, like not just like, hmm. but like if it doesn't happen, like I won't be surprised either because things change very quickly. But I'm, but I think hopeful is like the keyword. So what do you think 2022 is going to be like? What 2021 has taught me is you never know. So don't even think about it. And I can truly like it, 
Yeah, I have no idea. What I learned is you're able to adapt to anything.